Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to stop back at my channel. Okay, today I have a Dollar Tree haul, which is long overdue. It was supposed to be out on Tuesday. However, I've been super duper busy. If you saw me on Instagram, you know why. Um, and I had a doctor's appointment yesterday, so things are changing medically also for me um so today i have this huge haul and i mean it's huge the bags are stuffed filling over and i want to remind you guys i am uh stefano and i have started the keto um lifestyle so this haul has been done before i went and started my keto journey <laughs> which is like really crazy oh i know so boring huh boring so we are going to begin our haul right now. I do have a few things in here that are, don't belong in here, so I'm gonna take them out first. First thing I have is a book here. It is Women, Food, and Desire. Um, I wanna give this a nice read. So I am getting my book collection ready for the summer, even though I'm home all day long, but we go fishing a lot in the summer, so I like to read when we're fishing. Um, I was lucky enough to find, um, I'm, I, my kitchen is really in desperate need of an update. Um, hello. So I did get some of these nice coffee related towels. These are the hand towels on 100% cotton by the home collection. And then I found this one as well. I really, really like this one. She's bored with, um, the towels already. I got these pot holders also and then I did buy the uh, dish rags the dish cloths so there's two in there so that's not you know that's not bad I'm gonna take off my sweatshirt a little bit uh -uh, I'm hot I keep getting cold hot cold it's like a little bit cold here today so all right so I did get my whole milk um, so I do like to keep this on hand just in case of emergencies you know the lights go out whatever I will have milk here sugars are really high on this so I think I will I mean because there's really no fiber content in it so that means that the sugars are pretty high because there's zero fiber in here so the sugars are really high in this milk so I will have to search out um, some other milk for for us but that still is going to be good for um, for you know for emergencies and things and I am going to have I am going to have company soon and I don't want to you know make people live my lifestyle <laughs> so uh we do need a longer uh tongs for the grill um I I use mine but I am so short I can't reach the back of my of uh, my dryer so I use my tongs to get stuff out so that's where my long ones are so I have this so she is really bored today then I have this a sign I found. This is the BU sign. I really, really do like this sign. These signs are canvas. Um, they are really nice. I do like them. So I have a nice little collection These of black now. rubber bands. There's 500 in there. I use them for crafting things and other things. Um, I picked up some more of these little um, lip glosses. I got the watermelon. I got the watermelon, the berry, and the coconut. I have three of them, and I guess you guys can guess why. And they're for my granddaughters. <laughs> so I did pick up some mushrooms. Now this is fine for a keto diet. It is just fine. So I will continue to buy the olives, the mushrooms, the asparagus, things like that there, because they have frozen asparagus. Um, they also have bacon there that I can pick up. There's a little packs of bacon, 3.5 ounces of it. Um, I will pick up because that's good for me and Steph now, especially um, when you don't feel like counting out everything. It's five slices in there and that's all I, you know, I don't need five slices. I eat only two, maybe three because all of our life we've been told not to do fat, fat, fat. And now, so I'm a little bit nervous, so I'm not exactly doing a diet like I think I should be, but I'll discuss that in the coffee with Pam. All right, I got some black peppercorns there. I was really excited to find that they had the black, black peppercorns, so I did pick these up. This is uh, 1.3 ounces for a dollar, is not bad. Uh, I got myself this Hello Gorgeous. I love this. I'm gonna put my makeup brushes in this one. So I just thought it was really cute and they will be running out pretty soon, so there's not too many around. So I did pick up one. 
And again, they don't wrap things. Did you notice they don't wrap things? This That's my one aggravation spot with them. Um, I did have to pick up some more googly eyes. These ones are the colored ones. I love to use these in my craft projects on my cards and things that I make. So I did run out, so I had to make some, yeah, pick up some more. I am pretty excited about finding this because one, Stefano, need I say more, but I still want to give this a try. I hope it's as good as the poopery. Um, some people said it is. So, and then I just saw that it is made in China. Um, so, but it is a Greenbrier brand. So maybe these things will stick around for a while if they're Greenbrier. One can hope that they do as long as they work really well. So we will be testing these out. Now I did get pick up some fruit cocktail, and again, this is this is uh, well before I decided to do the keto. Um, now this it has 18 grams of sugar and only one gram of dietary fiber, so this would not be acceptable in my diet. So again, I do have you should see the two trash bag full of stuff that I have to donate to the church around the corner. So again, this will be going to the church unfortunately the only only um fruits i can have on the diet is blueberries raspberries strawberries blackberries and um honeydew melon that i know of um there's probably more i just don't know about them okay and then i did get these and these are 240 total hours and these are the um battery candles i need them for a little project that I will be doing. The rest of this is actually food that I'm going to be donating, so I'm not even going to be really showing it because there's no sense in it. Um, so, and then here is another uh, place that I went to. Um, it's another, it's pretty close to us, but not really. We were out and about. Stefano actually enjoyed four whole days off of work, so we went to different Dollar Street dollar trees and things like that um, I found this pomegranate cherry um, tea so I will be trying this out and it's good and uh, best used before 2021 so that's good I picked myself up another one of the uh, flamingo nails I don't have any nails on today and I didn't paint them but I did pick up these these are really really cute I've been seeing them all over now and I really did like this design um, for the coffee design. I really like that. I thought that was really nice. So I did pick up this one um, and I picked up the matching towel for it as well. So they didn't have the matching um, dishcloths. So I just picked these up. I got some toothbrushes here and these are the soft ones um and they are really good i like the soft because my gums tend to like um it's not very comfortable to brush with a harder brush so i do use a soft one so and this was a pretty good deal because it was two for a dollar so that's not bad and then stefano saw that they had power cord there because he makes those bracelets um so he picked himself up uh, I think five, four of these. So a black one, a green one, a pink one, and um, an orange one. And he said it wasn't a bad price for just uh, the Dollar Tree. He said it's a little bit thicker than what he's used to um, with his cord, but he will make it work. So he picked them up for himself. So I have to actually put them in his box. He has, a, he has his own little crafting box. <laughs> um, and then I picked up these little... Um, red white and blue flowers I thought that they were really cute so I did pick them up um, I actually wanted to make uh, one of the owls that I made for the holiday but they didn't have enough of these I would have really had to pick up probably like um, probably 20 of them to make that owl over there um, she took a lot of a lot my um, gloves that I got from the Dollar Tree already have ripped already um, in the garden because on Mother's Day I did my whole entire front. So all around my, my home I did it with the mulch and I got some plants and things. So it looks really cute out there. So, um, But I ripped my gloves because they were cloth. So these have like a rubber um, to them. So I picked these up. 
And then I thought it was funny when I saw this. And this is the inflatable uh, flamingo. I thought that was so funny. So I did, I did just pick up one for the summertime. So I don't know what I'll do with it, but I'll do something. And here's another one of the signs. This is here I got Imagine. So I really like that one as well. So now I got two of them. I did get some of the scrub buddies. I'm not nowhere near being um, done with all the ones I have because when we get the coupon, the 90, uh, the 10% coupon, I always stock up them because they're only 90 cents. So I have plenty. And again, this is this thing that really upsets me. I um, got some white potatoes and I think I got two cans of them. So again, this is not keto friendly, so we will not be using these. So I will be therefore giving them to um, the church around the corner. And I'm not sure, I don't think honey is allowed on the keto diet. I'm not sure about that. But these are new to me, um, and they are just little packets of honey. Um, I, I'm pretty sure that they are not allowed. Um, yeah, it has 16 grams of uh, sugar and zero grams of fiber. So these would not be allowed on the keto diet. These are also made in America. But I thought that they were really pretty cool because they are new. Um, and there's 10 in here. It would be good for the, on the go if you have tea and things like that. If you're not on the diet that we are on but this is really pretty um, convenient for you to take to work or whatever if you like tea and honey that would be perfect for you but I did pick these up I got myself some um, barrettes here um, this says clip on for blonde hair but I mean they're really cute so I didn't realize that they said uh, snap clips for blonde hair oh it says color matching yeah so they are color matching and they are for blondes. But what are you gonna do? I'm not a blonde anymore. <laughs> and then I got this uh, salt-free seasoning. Um, and it's just like, it's a blend of different things in here. I think Stefano picked this up because I don't remember putting this. I remember putting the pepper, but I don't remember putting this in there. So I guess it's just a bunch of different spices. I don't have my glasses on to reach you guys, which is unusual. I have thousands of glasses and I can't find them. Oh, I'm sorry about that, but he did pick up this. Uh, I guess there are seasonings in the back if you can see them because I just cannot. <laughs> I cannot see them. And then I, I fell in love with these and I know I probably won't use them. But they are just so cute. And it says any fin is possible. And I thought they were just so cute with the little two fishies. And <laughs> I just I just fell in love with it. So I'm going to put it over there. Again, the cute factor gets me every single time. And then here we found only one. And this is the second series. And it says collect them, stack them. And I only found one. This was the very last one that they had. Um, and I did ask the manager, they're not getting any more in. Um, I wish I was there when they were there because I would have liked to collect some for my granddaughters. And, you know, like I like to collect little things for them for Christmas and stuff or, you know. But this one has a Grumpy, Buzz Lightyear, and Winnie the Pooh. So that is the ones that this one has. So I will definitely be keeping my eye out for these because I think they're really cute. And my granddaughters, I know, they um, they love things like that. And so, what else did I get here? Oh, okay. So, this was yesterday. I just was out at the doctor's and we were near the Dollar Tree. So, I stopped in. I got these self-adhesing um, hooks. And these are the silver ones that holds up the three pounds. Now, I got the four white ones. Um, and I have to tell you, I'm really disappointed in them. They don't stick. They just do not stick. They look like command hooks, but they definitely are not command hooks. They do not stick. Um, I had a picture up. It stuck for a little bit, and then all of a sudden, bam, it fell down on the ground. So, and then I got out another pack. Same thing happened. Half hour later, it fell down. And the picture does not weigh anything. It's so light because it's a canvas. It's very, very light. So, um... I'm not sure why it did it and then I went and I felt it and there's no sticky on it at all. So I got a whole three packs of them and I don't know what I'm going to do because I opened up 
two of them so but it's really stinks so i hope that these are a little bit better so if anybody's used these please let me know and it doesn't say what the it just says well this is a green briar brand um so that's it and then um then i found these these are watermelon um stefano really likes these he says he likes the watermelon so i'm gonna to have to go back and get them they're made with stevia five packs of them and it's the true lime so i like the black the black cherry uh limeade i like that one and i got the peach the peach lemon limeade uh peach lemonade so i got them we've been drinking these they are made with stevia stefano did tell me though he looked it up and he did say that it, there is a little bit of sugar in there one total gram of sugar um and there is no fiber in it so it does have one gram of sugar in there so that's not too bad one gram so he'll be able to get rid of that quickly but you know so we got these so i'm going to stock up on these if i find them again but i i wanted to try the watermelon so i'm going to try that today and then if anybody um asked me about the crest white i think it is doing a really good job for my teeth um so i don't have i have before pictures and i'm going to give it a total week right now i've only been using it four days so it's not a total week but i do want to give it a total week and i do do it twice a day i do it after my first morning coffee because i do have coffee um and then i do it um like right after i have my coffee and then then, um, I will do one more time in the middle of the afternoon um, with the teeth right whitening and then I just brush my teeth regular before I go to bed so you know I'm just hoping that it will help I do take a lot of medication and a lot of medications affect your teeth they can make them soft they can make them um, discolored and things like that so you know I do have a lot of problems with my teeth so I am doing this but I do think that it is helping and I do think I do see them getting whiter but they're not where I want them to be yet so you know but I did pick up two more and they're hard to find because not a lot of the stores have them. So you really have to search for them. And the last thing that I got, oh no, not the last thing. This is it. Um, that I did, I was able to find the unicorn pens. These were the only two that they had, but I was really excited to find them. So I did get myself two of them. I didn't pick any up for my granddaughters. Um, so I don't know. I just didn't, I didn't pick any up. So I did get two pens here. So I think that these are so stinking cute. I love them. They were in different colors. I didn't take a picture because I was standing in line at the time and I had to hurry because the lady behind me was all aggravated. So um, I did go and just pick up two of these. So I think that they're really cute. I really do. So I didn't check them to make sure that they work. And again, I don't understand why they do this. I can't, can't they just do it down here or something? Like, I don't know. So, but these are really cute. The last thing that I did get, which I was totally, totally excited about when I saw it, were these. And the lady's like, do you want me to wrap them? Well, yeah. So, okay. So I got two of them. This is the owl. Isn't that cute? It lights up. You could put it out by your steps. Um, they had frogs and they had owls. And I got two of the owls and they are solar lights. So, but they are again made, um, they are um, ceramic, pretty heavy, but they are solar, but they are really, really cute. So I did pick up, up two of them and you have to watch the back. Some of them weren't actually glued in there really well. They were like, you know, half in and half out. So I got the two best ones I could find. So again, some things are really cute, but they're really put together. Not that great. So, um, I have been double checking things, especially since I bought, um, since I got so upset about these, um, they are not put together very well. They're like just slapped together. They're not, you know, there's like little, you know, they're missing, like they're not even straight. So, you know, I've learned my lesson from these because when I went back, all the rest of them were just as bad as this one. So there was no sense of, you know, I just kept them. 
but you know so I've been noticing like the mirrors and things are cracked and broken there's been a lot of things just thrown up on on the shelves so you know that is my haul guys I will be back to my normal hauls on Saturdays the only difference is now there will not be food if there's food and it's new to the store what I will do is I will take a picture of that food for you guys so you guys can see what is new out there it's just our lifestyle is now changed um, I think it's actually going to help me with my fibromyalgia and my Sjogren's um, so and I do have a pretty important um, coffee with Pam coming up I'm going to film that in a little bit um, because there's a lot of things I just found out from my doctor and I really do want to share them with you guys all right guys I hope you have an amazing day and like I always say somehow some way I'll have an amazing day you make your day amazing and together friends we'll have an amazing day I'll see you in my next video